I just love how much you... <laughs> Hello. <Are> you... <laughs> hey. Hi, my name is Al McFadgen. I'm the Dairy Knowledge Exchange Manager for AHDB for the north of England. Um, today, I'm at one of our strategic farms, and this is Shona. She's one of the employees here. Why did you, why did you come into agriculture in the first place? I don't think you know. I was a tattoo artist for a little bit, and lockdown hit, and I was tattooing a milk milkmaid, as you call it, and so she was milking. So she was like, why don't you come see how we milk cows? And the second I walked into it, I couldn't leave. <laughs> I couldn't leave. That was it. I quit all my other other work and I just went full time into agriculture. As many courses, that's how I met yourself, yeah. as I possibly could. All of the um, university, college things that I can do and forward I will be doing. Um, and now I've started to help like more people with their young stock. Um, when they, you know, they ask me questions and things like that. I'm no vet, but I'm very, very, very passionate about the welfare of the cows and the babies. Shona, could you give us a little bit more information as to why, why you didn't want to leave the farm once you... Once I, you... well, first of all, I fell in love with the animals themselves. They're so curious, they're so lovely. And then coming to work here, you just meet... So I don't know how to uh, put it into the best way possible, but they're just so inclusive of absolutely everything. You can never do anything wrong. They've got all the patience in the world to teach you. And if you're willing to learn, You'll never, you'll never go wrong. And whatever you're willing to learn, as I absolutely love, and anyone who's wanting to come into it, it's a great way, and you can progress. Yeah. That's not just it. Like you're not just uh, like an office job. You do your job, and you're stuck. You know that's what you do. You get paid. You go home. Here, you, <laughs> hello. You come in, and you you work your way up. Sort of. You, you know. You maybe you start off just a helping farm hand, and you get to work your way up through it and eventually I would like to be more involved in the, the welfare, the health plans of the cows and the health plans of the calves and more like that. And I just, I just love how much you, <laughs> hello, you <laughs> hey, um, how you, you just can't go wrong. They just include you in absolutely everything. Um, they are so lighthearted, they're so kind as well. And Debbie is a fantastic mother to us all. Yeah. Whenever something goes wrong, she is the one who keeps all of our heads screwed on. And it's like a family, in, in an essence. Um, you know, you can ring each other up if you're ever in an issue. You, you build a whole network of friends that it's almost a bond that's unbreakable. And I, I would never swap it. I'd never swap it for a different job. Doing other jobs prior, I'd never leave. Thank you, Shauna. That was really, um, it's going to be really inspiring for people to see just why you should be involved in agriculture, I think.